Hey everybody, it's Lowsted97. Welcome back to more Let's Play SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. In the last episode, we finished up everything at Rock Bottom for now. And in this episode, we're gonna start our quest um, to get caught up on a few socks. So in this video, all I'm gonna be doing is um, this video, all I'm gonna be doing is getting the socks in Jellyfish Fields. Next video. I will be uh, getting the socks in downtown bikini bottom and so on. And I'll probably stop sock videos. Uh, I don't know really when actually. So real quick, I want to take a look at, our, look at our menu. And we have zero out of 14 socks. So how about we get started on these socks here. Um, first thing you're going to need to do uh, to get started on your socks. Sock collecting of uh, jellyfish shields. Jeez. As you can see, there is a sock out there. Now, if you take this box, I believe it'll land you right next to near a bus stop, right? Or is that just my imagination acting up? Okay, it's my imagination acting up again. But anyways, um, we're near a bus stop. I do know that. So yeah, we'll just have to travel a little bit. There is a little bit of traveling for these socks, so if you're impatient like myself, this may not be place for you oh, I don't know. um so yeah our first sock we need Patrick for though so I do need to go and get Patrick I need to freaking find him and there is a bus stop over here okay good now if you just hit pause and then you like go back somewhere um you will turn into whatever character that mission is for so like if I were to go to this bus stop and get Patrick and then go back and um, like just press pause go back and get uh, just hit pause and go back to that mission where that sock was I would lose Patrick and I would turn back into Spongebob so yes it is a little ways away but you know it's not that big of a deal so here we have Patrick um, Patrick is going to take us back all the way to the, be to the beginning of the level. And as him, we obviously need to get that sock. Now, Patrick is um, pretty bad at platforming, as you may have guessed. So, with Patrick here, you need to be very careful. Ow. You need to be very careful about your platforming, or else you're never going to make it back to where you need to go. Like, there's a very slim chance that you make it back to where it is you need to go if you screw things up with Patrick here. So, how about we now head back to Jellyfish Rock, Jelly, Jellyfish Rock, Jellyfish Rock, Jellyfish Rock, Jellyfish Rock, okay, I don't know. But yeah, um, this is another reason you want to make sure you have the boxes, because if you didn't have the boxes, oh my god, would this take forever! Yeah, this would take like. See, as you can say there, Patrick says a little clip. Um, but yeah, with Patrick here now, what we need to do is quite actually pretty simple. We just need to go over here. There's a fruit with Patrick right there that I don't think you need. Um, we are just interested in the freezy fruit. That's really all we care about at this point right now. So, let's pick it up and toss it. And then we can go on the ice. And get sock number one. See, here's the thing, though, about the socks. Like, if you're picking them up as Patrick, which you're going to be, I believe, doing that a lot in this course. Why don't you just freaking, um... Why, why don't you just like, um, why don't you just go and get it with, I, 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 I don't know. Why don't you just like get the spatulas automatically? I have no freaking idea, I guess. The game logic, I guess, man, whatever, man. Alright, so for the next sock we need to get, we need to head on over here. Just keep jumping, just keep jumping with Patrick, why the heck not? And we get sock number two in Jellyfish Fields. That is our 13th sock in this game. Alright. Patrick's gonna be one happy camper. So 
let's just do that. And I'll meet you guys at where our next sock is. Okay, so one sec. Okay, now the rest of them here we can uh, most likely get with SpongeBob, I think. There might be a couple of them with Patrick, but the, be the ones that are in the beginning we can probably just get with SpongeBob. I don't really think we're going to need Patrick for much. So at the beginning here, um, instead of taking this bridge, you want to head over here and you're going to see a little detour off in the distance. You obviously want to take this detour. Uh, because this detour will take you to a little cave with a sock at the end of it. Okay, so that's sock number three of Jellyfish Fields. Awesome. Alright, next, you need to stand on this. You need the bubble bowl for this. Bowl away! And you get a sock! Alright, pretty simple sock, I do say, Sam Shelf. Alright, that is sock number 4 out of 14. Sorry, only 10 more to go. It's going by fast. Alright, next. Uh, so, what we did as Patrick is we followed this little flower path here. But for this sock, what you need to do is um, jump on this first flower and have it take you to this little mountain right over here. This will land you next to uh, this fountain in which you can grab that sock that's been taunting you for a very, very long time if you're using this as a walkthrough video. Um, and if you've been following along with me, if not, then probably not. But anyways, there's that sock, 5 out of 14. Alright, for your next uh, sock here, you need to beat the slide, and you need to stay as far right as you possibly can. Now there's going to be a little hidden passageway uh, right here. Alright. Right on this hidden passageway is going to be a sock for you to grab right there. Now if you stay on this path, and I believe that you have to jump for it, there's a sock right there. Alright, there you go. 7 out of 14. See you guys momentarily. Okay, right here, it's a little bit before King Jellyfish, actually. Our next sock, right here by this little ice freezy fruit. We want to head down here and get sock number 8. Yay, 8 out of 14, yay, I got a sock, okay. Okay, this next sock is a little bit tricky. Now, if we look here, um, I believe there's a sock up there. Is that where it is? Now, um, it's by this cave, okay? It's by the cave with all the hammer robots and stuff, but, um, what this, what there is back here is, I believe, whoa, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, D -d is it up here? Is it right to go up here? I don't think I was. Okay. So that's just a little shortcut for money. Now, where this next sock actually is, if I can stop screwing up, is, um, over here... Now, over here, if I can freaking talk, okay? You're gonna notice, uh, there's a sock around here somewhere. Yeah, it's, the sock is, um, right over there. As you can see, it kind of glowing up there. So, what we need to do to get the sock is we need to navigate a little bit, okay? When you get up here, you're gonna notice it's kind of over there-ish. Alright? So, if you go over here, um... You need to, like, kind of take an alternate pathway. I believe. Where is the alternate? Alright, like I said, I apologize. It's just been a very, very long time since I have played this. Alright, I believe. Is it up here? I hope it is. Like I said, platforming is Patrick. Not the best idea, but hey. There's a bus stop down there, too. So that's just freaking wonderful. Um. Just die. Freaking die. Okay. So. There is a sock by where that hammer thing was, okay? Why? By the start of the cave where all those hammers were, alright? But to get to it, I do know that you need to take a little bit of an alternate pathway. Uh, let's see. Alternate pathway. Sock is over there. And how am I... Oh, there's a flower there, doy. So... Whoa. Oh god, oh god, I'm, I'm dead. Woo, I don't live. All right, can I please make this? Yay! Oh, what? 
BRB. Okay. Please, sir. Uh, please let me make the jump, sir. And flower time! No! No, no, what? What? <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Okay, freaking go through it again. <clears throat> Come on, jeez. Alright, just, you know, some of the socks in here get pretty freaking annoying. Alright. Now, I have to go all the way back up here on my alternate pathway. Well, this is the normal pathway, but, you know, you get the picture, guys. Okay, let's just go, please. I don't want to freaking do this anymore. Die and die again. Thank you for dying. Have a nice day. In Deathland. I don't freaking know where I was going with that. But I, I made it happen. I'm proud of myself for that part. Okay, let's just kill you and for the dozenth time. Jeez, holy crap. Take this little alternate pathway. Alright, it's a little difficult, so make sure you're good. Because, you know, Patrick kind of sucks. I freaking hate Patrick. Jump over here, get your sock. Sock number 9 out of 14. Jeez, oh, Pete's. Okay, this next one is on King Jellyfish's slide. So what we need to do is we need to just keep going down here like we normally would. And uh, remember that first turn that you have to make, you know, that one, yeah, that I just now did not want to make. You don't want to make that. Okay, wait, what? Wait, 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 no, uh, dang it. <sighs> okay, if I could do this right, that'd be perfect. Thanks, game, jeez. Okay, for the dozen freaking time, let's go down the slide, King Jellyfish's slide, and keep going. Now, on the first turn, you don't want to make it, you just want to stay straight. I believe that was it, and I believe this is the cave with the sock in it, right? It freaking better be. Yes, it is. There's your sock. Have a good day. Ha ha. Okay, now that we've gotten a lot of our socks here, we've gotten 10 out of 14. Um, how about we save a couple more of them for next time, okay? But I uh, think, yeah, now we're going to end things off here. But I've been doing a lot of work on shiny objects, though, so I'd kind of like to go get that taken care of, okay? Now, what I'm going to do is, off camera, I'm going to go and I'm going to get a bunch of freaking shiny objects, alright? So I will be right back. <sighs> that took me like 40 minutes! Yes. Alright. Now, what's the next one that he wants? I'm gonna look at my pause menu and take a look at that really quick. If it'll go. Okay. Pause, go down. Mr. Krabs, we have one more thing for him. 7,500. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna do it. I'll be right back. Freaking shiny objects. I'm a freaking madman. Okay, I'll talk to Mr. Krabs. Holy crap. I am tired now. Wow. That was crazy. Okay. Before I go here. Uh, we've actually gotten a lot of stuff done in this video. I'm pretty proud, actually. Before I go here. I know a lot of you are dying to see what's back here. How about I take a look at it? Because I'm insane. One minute, please. Which is going to be like freaking 30 minutes for me. Ah. <sighs> Oh, look, 41,000 shiny objects. Hello, sir, may I help you? One little bit of my baby. Oh. Yes, sir. Oh, 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 oh. Let's enter the, the theater. <laughs> okay. The big battle for Bikini Bottom concept art. Okay, see, um, this is just a bunch of slideshow pictures of concept art of the game that they had. 
Which is really cool. I wish they would have kept some of these in. Like, look at that. That's awesome. That one's really cool. You know, I wish they would have done something like that. Um, that's kind of a spoiler. That, that would have been really freaking awesome. I wonder actually if that's supposed to be rock bottom. That guy, that would have been a cool enemy. Those would have all been cool enemies. Oh, uh, that's another spoiler. That's uh, that guy, you know, same guy. That is even another spoiler. Wait, no, no, it's not. No, it isn't. We saw him in the murder lair. It's sleepy time. Oh God. Uh, I don't think he was actually used. He's pretty awesome. He's pretty stupid. I freaking hate that guy. Hate that guy. You know that's pretty cool too. Him, we already thought. Ah, uh, that would have been that. That is an awesome fight. This, I wish. Well, actually, they do another spoiler. Ah, uh, that's an unused cover. Maybe it is used in some parts of the world. I don't really know. You know, I wish they would have done this too. That would have been so cool. Like some of the stuff they really should have done. That guy was not used. That guy was not used. That was not used. See, just some of the stuff is just so cool, you know? Like, that was never used, a Goo Lagoon. That was never used. You know, there's all this, like, precise platforming and crap that would have been so cool. That's kind of a spoiler. Um, another spoiler. Uh, that, I think, is supposed to be the robot machine, I guess. I don't really know. <laughs> they should have done something with that too. Like, there's a lot of things that they could have done in this game. There you go. There's all the concept art. All right, and it says coming soon. Hey, it's already here. LOL. All right. I think now that we've done a lot of friggin' stuff in this video, we're ending it off here. Okay, I can't take any more. Next time on SpongeBob Battle from Key Bottom, I will finish up the socks actually for Shield. See you guys then. Bye.